Animals in My Hair, read for you by Millie Fay. This is the story of my very first haircut. It begins with a loving pat, a mother's soft kiss on my head. Then, your hair, it's a forest, suddenly she said. My hair, a forest? Whatever could she mean? In a moment we were off, to I had no clue where. I skipped and I hopped till a bright building was there. Inside were many people, new noises and smells. The snipping of scissors, the fanning of fans, the brushing of brushes, the stepping of shoes, the flower-scented bottles, the tear by tears, the laughter, and music called blues. We waited forever, and ever, and ever, it seemed, before a man bowed to my mother like a knight to his queen. I want it gone, pointing at my hair, she imperiously said. All gone, madam? With her nod to a high chair, I was led. The man, who was the barber, wrapped a cloak around my neck. Armed with a comb, he was ready in a sec. Then he attacked. Fighting with tangles, fighting with curls, the poor barber yanked, the poor barber pulled. Until with one last effort, and to the wonder of us all, a ginormous polar bear landed on the floor. A puzzled snow-white polar bear, amidst the screams and loud cries of woe, in confusion and fear, pawed his way out, crashing straight through the wall. One polar bear. The barber gave another yank. Lo and behold! Two peery caribou tumbled to the floor. On their spindly legs, clearly offended, heavy gray coats they shook. With a proud tilt of their heads they went, while with bafflement we looked. Two peery caribou. Yank, yank, yank. Three pink eastern cougars landed on the floor. Now, some of you may say, there are no such things as pink cougars. They are orange, reddish brown, and gray. Well, this is my story. I said they were pink, and pink they will stay. Three pink eastern cougars. The barber was perplexed. How many more? To the astonished eyes of customers, the following fell to the floor. Four yellow swift foxes swishing their long tails. A flock of five whooping cranes whooping their hails. Six greater prairie chickens clucked through the door. Seven black-footed ferrets following their score. Eight Kirtland's warblers blew in the face they went. Nine spotted owls to the wall were sent. Ten green Pygmy short-horned lizards popped out of my hair, and a final yank proved they were the last ones there. My hair was combed out, but what a fluffy mess! So my barber continued not taking a rest. He washed it, conditioned it, he trimmed it, dried it, he styled it. At last he held up a mirror. For the first time in my life, I could actually see me. I look good. My mother was thrilled, my hair a forest no more, while with all of those animals combed out of my hair, a zoo opened next door. The end. That is my story. Believe what you will. I remember it all. I remember it still. Thank you for listening to Animals in My Hair. Please stay tuned to find out how you can access the Animals in My Hair members pages to my website where you can download coloring pages, artwork, and learn more about each animal as well as find the answers to all the hidden visual puzzles throughout the book. If you've really liked my book after you've experienced everything it has to offer, I would appreciate you leaving a brief review on Amazon. Just say you received a copy in exchange for an honest review. Thank you very much 
Now stay safe, stay home, and this is Millie Fay wishing you only the best. Bye. So welcome to my iPad screen, and I'm just going to quickly show you how you can access the members pages. So what you need to do is go into your browser, and my website is really easy. It's artofmillie.ca. So once you're there, you'll need to scroll down to books. And once you access the books, you need to scroll down again and find animals in my hair, which will take you to animals in my hair page has all of the information you need. Now usually this Animals in My Hair members pages are locked but because of this virus I decided to open them up uh, until everybody is out of the quarantine stage. And as you can see here you'll be able to answer visual puzzles, find answers. So the visual puzzles if you don't know are little hidden puzzles that I have throughout the book. And once you've discovered them all, you can check and make sure that you did discover them all. So if we go back, you can also download coloring pages, learn more about Animals in My Hair Animals, and as well download bonus artwork that you can print and hang in your child's room. So if we go into coloring pages, you'll see that it's really easy uh, to download. You just click on that button here. And now these are the coloring pages that I have currently available. And once you click on this button, it will take you to uh, my OneDrive file. Where you'll be able to download the coloring page of your choice. And I think that's all you need to know. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to contact me through my website. Thank you again and stay safe and stay home. Bye.